going. Okay, so this is the process when you were opening a new tube of glue. So when you are using the manual, you want to cut it at 5 sixteenths. When you're using the automatic gun, you cut it in between because it's a lot more powerful. So I cut it in between and then you cut that little lip off so you can have a little lip there. The channel that the glue comes out of easily without this having to look at it. Electric gun looks like. This is the manual. And then you always stab the... Make sure you get all the foil. All the foil so that it comes out smooth. I just use wire. This is the crucial part. This mm. makes it so that you save your glue throughout the day. On the manual or on the automatic, I like to turn it up just a little bit, but you want to make sure you go really slow. Once you see that glue come up through the tube here, you want to go really slow through the whole process because if you don't, you will have glue bleeding on you through the whole tube and you'll just waste a bunch of glue. So the slower the better and you can save your product that way. It gets everywhere. It gets on your car, it gets on your trunk when you open and shut it. If you let the glue just go wild and you let it bleed everywhere, it just gets on everything. So ideally, um, uh, um, it's just a question of where you spend your time. A little extra here to get this through that tube like she's taken all the time to do or the extra time to clean up the mess that you make from being in a hurry. So trigger release and I put it back down to the normal setting. And then always once you're done gluing the numbers you get this spot in your box and that's what keeps everything clean in your car. And that's it. Doesn't matter how fast you go from there.